Hi. I mounted my Balba films on a cork bark and I wanted to show it to you. This one is my favorite. I like the look of this piece of bark. They all originally came as the rounds and I had to cut them to make them flat. But this one I decided to keep as round because I think it looks just great as, as is. Like when it stands like this, I like it. And I chose this plant. This is a um, Pablothelum Clouds Dragonfire. Because when I unpotted it, it came into three pieces. And I thought, oh, I will mount it from the three sides on this little bark log. And then it will climb up and up and grow. And eventually maybe fill up all the uh, all this piece. That would be awesome. So this is um, Balbathelum Clown's Dragonfire. Next one is Balbathelum Macrantum. Uh, during the last update we didn't see this uh, start of a new bulb here. And now it's there, so the plant is growing. And this uh, piece of bark originally was round and I cut it into three pieces to mount three bulb of films. So Macrantum got this piece. Hopefully it likes it. I kept sphagnum around the roots for now. I don't know if it's needed because tank is humid. But just uh, in the beginning, maybe, maybe then I will pull it out. I don't know. Just to let the plant adjust itself on the mound. I will keep moss for a while. I think it looks it's okay. The next one is Bulbophyllum Kalimpong. That's the bulb that I bought from uh, Piping Rock Orchids at the Montreal Orchid Show. In the pot there was two pieces of the plant. It came into two pieces when I unpotted it, so I decided to mount them both on the same mount because it's the same plant. When it adjusts, I hope it will provide nice display. Those pieces of bark, they have flat bottom, so they are standing. I like that. I don't want to hang this bulbophyllum high because it might be too bright for them up on the wall. So they look good standing like this. And the last one is bulbophyllum lasiochylum or lasiochylum. It has several leads with new bulbs grown, so I think it should fill up this uh, log at some point, this piece of log. And I could actually hang it, but uh, I decided to keep it just like this down with the uh, seashell at the end, just for, I don't know, I think it looks nice. So those are my mounted bubble films. Macrantum, uh, Clouds Dragonfire, Kalimpo, and Lazio Shilum. Lazio To accommodate them, I had to rearrange my tank. It used to have shelves, and um, I had the spots on the shelves. But with shelves, they, uh, those mounts didn't look that nice. Shelves were kind of overpowering the mounts. So I removed the shelves, and I just put plants in groups. Vanilla moved into the corner 
because she was sticking out too much there in the middle but the fan moved with her so she still gets some air movement I put my Phalaenopsis seedlings into a shaded place here and there and those are my tender seedlings I finally figured out how they want to grow they don't want any medium at all in their pots so they are growing nicely in the clay pots with their roots these are tricolors and those are insignis and those are albino tricolors that I just defluffed recently and here are my seedlings of multifloral Pathia pedlums. They like it warm and humid and they like bright light. And here are Pathia pedlums that don't like bright light so much. Those are Gigantifolium or Gigantifolium and Anitums and uh, Fenderianums. And what else? Oh, fall parks. And this is the start of my um, succulents collection. This is a cutting of um, a string of pearls <clears throat> that I got from Karina. She sent me a, a cutting from her plant. I just find this plant so bizarre and uh, wonderful. I wanted to have it. So I'm trying to root these cuttings in the, it's a well-drained mix. I'm going to keep it humid to, uh, to grow the roots. So we'll see if it will work. And, uh, well, that's all for now. I'm planning to buy more bark pieces and mount my Phalaenopsis ceilings and hang them on this wall and probably on that wall too where there's not much light and maybe some uh, cattleyas to mount and put here that's in the future for now these are my mounts Thank you for watching. Have a nice day.